year. <laughs> a, a stream disconnect on the first episode. Come on. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. Welcome back, full fans, peasants. Welcome back, full fans, peasants. Oh, that's really frustrating. Just uh, got through such an amazing section of the game. Uh, finding Clive, fighting Tier Matt, fighting Jill. Did I say finding Clive? Oh no, I, I'm actually really triggered. <laughs> Sorry about the DC guys. Uh, I have my sweet darling Brianna coming in four days with a, a device that's going to help stabilize this goddamn Colombian internet. It's very booty bum cheeks. But <laughs> that's what sucks because we had like 120 homies in the stream. Which is great, it was great. Great energy, great vibes, and now we've lost them all. <laughs> well, well, it happens. Easy come, easy go. It just, uh, it just sucks. Uh, the internet here, it looks like, even though it's like 300 meg upload and 200 download, which is very fast, it just, it's not stable. Even in all the places I've been in Colombia, it just blips out. Which, for YouTube, uh, it just means you have to restart the stream. Anyway, welcome back, guys. Sting up that like button, smash it, kid it, and uh, I don't know, I think um, I was weighing up whether or not this was the best opening in all of Final Fantasy. What do you guys think? For your first three hours. So we've just done about three hours, I've carried over the save demo. Besides the actual opening openings, I do think Final Fantasy has some legendary cutscene openings. You know, Type Zero's cutscene opening. Eights. I mean, damn, even the, just the magical wonder and beauty of Nine's opening. Um, also, Ten was very solid as well. With Oren and uh, obviously the Blitzball Stadium, Zanakin exploding. And Fifteen's was pretty cool with the uh, obviously the Ifra opening, the car push, but all of that aside, these are the best three hours in any Far Fantasy. I can say that right now. This for me might be the best opening three hours. The only criticism I have is that they reused the Ifrit Phoenix um, event <clears throat> twice in those three hours, which I didn't like that. I didn't like that. Oh, okay. So we got is the seven crystals, yo. So I've got the five. Oh wow, we get to actually see the whole map. Ah, so we've got Willow's Crystal. Right, they're not showing any other like significant map points. Ah, it's this sinkhole. This, is, this sinkhole I'm very curious about. What made this? What's down there? I think we see him on the trailers, like this water gets like splooshed off of it. Who's in the house, guys? Ah, oh, 64 of you came back. Oh, we only lost half our audience. <laughs> I don't know, what do you think? Eight, eights is the best. I think for, for singular cutscene, eight was just mind blowing for the time. Mind blowing. Wow, this is a really cool map, man. And now we've got the uh, hidden Northern Territory section. Where is their crystal? Was it once there? So are these, are these chains actually a thing? Is, it, is this how they actually <laughs> like separated? The national borders, the actual chains. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's something happening out here in these waters, guys. Right here. They blurred it out on the map, and there's something sketchy happening. <clears throat> I enjoyed 12's opening. Those are a little strong. Those are very, very strong. Uh, right to the hideaway, with the withered remnants of the once verdant valley along, uh, long consumed by the Bly. Ah, so the hideaway is in a blighted area. One would have to be the extremely foolish, extremely desperate, well, an extremely desperate fool, to make this wasteland their home. Hey, cook Gabriella, mate, Subaru. What's up? <clears throat> uh, just need to quickly pull up my Twitch chat. I cannot see you, Twitch. You still in the house? Over there. I'm a regard out. Okay, to the hideaway. <clears throat> Did pairs. The whole game is, is blurred out. There, there's specific say. Basically, there's a mystery in the northern seas, alright? And it's got to be juicy. Maybe. The 
Not much further now. But we're in the middle of the Deadlands. <clears throat> Aye, you. The blight sucked this place dry. Meaning no trees, no birds, and no magic. But it also means no neighbors. We do like no neighbors. Anyone would think to look. Does anyone, or has anyone ever actually liked their neighbors? Or really even spoken to them? Being that I have a habit of screaming for hours on end on streams, Home every neighbor I've ever had has hated me. <laughs> if you heard a guy next door screaming about all kinds of crazy ass nonsense about Diabloses, Yaud Boths, Persona 5 waifus, you probably hate him too. Alright. Our base of operations, so... This place... These are fallen ruins. Yeah, well, ancient civilization tech. Mine. And it keeps the black from our lungs. But how do you survive without magic? Interesting. How does anyone? Hard work and a bit of nerve. So the Unless tech... We're starving. We grow them here. Is stopping the blight from getting them. Hmm? Suit yourself. Oh. You're back. There's, there's a tie in there somewhere. And this is the dominant. How cold since we found her. I was hoping you might give her a look over. All right. Good. That's old, what's her name? What's her name? The ginger in 14 with a really dark story. Food. 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 She's the best healer this side of the belt. I'm not thinking of saying Futaba. Fatima. Ah. Have a look around. What was her name? Solo. You know who I'm talking about, guys. So that that, that that was some interesting stuff right there. This place is built out by an ancient civilization that fell 1,500 years ago. The whole fall, fall of the forebearers. I'll be talking about how the Adam and Eve story is definitely entwined in this. In terms of how that evolves out afterwards, very biblical, very biblical. And just after we get that reference, Sid's there with an apple. He does a whole thing with an apple. They be pointing. They be pointing. Ah, it's really bothering me. What's the ginger's name in 14? She reminds me of her so hard. Uh, FF14 Ginger. <laughs> she had such a cool, cool story arc. Typing FF14 Ginger is just getting me a bunch of ginger people who play 14. <laughs> What's her name? Can't get a good ginger. What? What? <laughs> well, the ginger I'm thinking of wasn't good. Oh, come on, guys. Someone, someone in the house remind me. Fordola! Of course, yes, Fordola. It's named Fordola esque. Right. <clears throat> Let's check out the other one. I want to go see a Moogle. So they they had to layer a whole separate um, rendering processor just for Moogles. They couldn't make them look right when it switched Still between hungry, the. Uh... Might have some around here. Yeah, I don't want to oh. talk to the cantankerous crone. I can tell I hate her. Right, let's check everything out. Yeah, when it switched between the, the high-res scenes um, <laughs> and the gameplay, the Moogles look like naked rats or hedgehogs. They're like, we can't do it, Yoshi P. And Yoshi P he pulled out a dagger, he stabbed it into the uh, dev table with all them around. He said, I want my fucking Moogles! Make it happen! Sheathed his dagger and walked out. Another newcomer. You mind the rules round here, or our next chat will be through the bars. I remember the first time I came across this G word when we went up against Titan in 14. I thought it was Gayola. <laughs> Another it's just newcomer. Jailer. 
You mind the rules round here, or our next chat will be through the bars. Leave me alone, Gaiola. Well, this is all very slummy. I like it. The washroom floor's all mended then. It will hold for now. Very cool. Very, very, very cool. Oh, there's a tree over there. How's a tree growing? Oh, kick the cock. How you got this thing working, mate? Oh, it's got, it's got some. Oh, it's got Moogle in it. It's Moogle magic, of course. Can I fire a fireball at him? Sid once told me, the blight doesn't kill the land. It only makes her forget who she once was. Our oh, chat is frozen on screen. Remember her purpose. Thank you for letting me know, my All dear. She is a little reminding. Let me re restart it. Hopefully that works. Oh, I've just killed the chat entirely. <laughs> I can't wait until Brie comes here. <laughs> Not just to see her, but also set. So these annoying little issues just bang, just disappear. All right, there we go. Everyone give me a hoop hoop holler, the 101 people who are in the house. Thanks for coming back, guys, after the DC. Give me a yell out in the chat. Let's see if the chatbot's working. So again, no spoilers, my friends. Sid, from what you've played. Me, the blight doesn't kill the land. Of six things so far. Work. However much that is. Are you loving? Is it everything you hoped for and more? Is it... On point with your expectations? Lower, higher? Your brand. Lady Tyre might be able to see to that. You may have been born a slave, but you're a free man now. You're a free man now. Ah, hello guys. Hello, Abaruski. Bit annoying that the, the chat, chat bot says it was picking it up and it's not. Leave me be. <laughs> not until you've had your medicine. This guy are sick. Oh man, this makes me very upset. Uh, oh, I may need to quickly grab a new... Uh, I think I know what it is. Uh, I just need to restart the stream. Uh, Chatbot. Uh, studio sound. Let's go. Let's go talk to the wench, the mean wench. I suppose I'll be needing a new suit. Then you'll need to speak to Blackthorn. Suppose I'll have time to explore all of this. And I'll start getting quests in a minute. Are you? Might have some around here. Oh, <laughs> speak with Sid in his chambers. That's the mission. <laughs> Oh, he's got one of those Just working on a pet project at night. Though she's not above biting the hand that feeds her. Scene between these boys. I'm gonna pop into active time law. Yes, I probably missed some. Can you go back historically and see some? That's really annoying. This, 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 this chat, this chat bot, it's just, it's broken. Ow. Ow. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, oh, yes, I see. I see. I've, I've got to add the event. Yes, I see. <laughs> right, there we go. <clears throat> um, just about to start. Need to find some appropriate snacks first. 
I'm going to be eating like garbage or 16's out. Garbage food in mainland Final Fantasies. Yes, going back to my teenage years. What did everyone purchase? Uh, physical or digital? I'm a peasant, so I've uh, got the digital, and I ain't got the, the digital deluxe. Digital basic. But I hear some people have been uh, <clears throat> not been getting their copies. Refuge in the Blighted Lands Central Storm, from which Sid operates his secretive community. Um, a combination of new indestructible fallen ruins and considerable ingenuity have led to the establishment of a safe haven. Cornered by a battalion of Viking Crusaders, spirit him and jail away. Right, not much, not much in there. Ah, okay. I've, yep, I've just managed to. Sorry about these tech issues, guys. It's most booty bootyolus. There we go. Chat's working again. <laughs> I was hoping we might try and solve the mystery of poor Clive Rossfield, a bearer of the San Imperial Army sent behind enemy lines. With orders to wait until it turned into a brawl, then slit the dominant's throat in the chaos. I didn't know it was her. How could it be? Y'all were still going to do it, to sir. To save her neck, you slit your sergeants, then set your sights on the hills, conveniently forgetting how the Empire deals with deserters. Because with that on your chop, my friend, we both know you won't be getting far. You've fallen a long way, Lord Rossfield. All right, ma'am, don't use your judgments. But, but I do want your boobs. <clears throat> I'll not have it said that I'm a poor host. What do you mean to do with her? Do with her? Why nothing? Her life is her own now. If Sid is a humanitarian. You, do you think I'd be talking to you? All I want to do is help. Dominance like her, branded like you. Of course, the realm doesn't approve. Sid's a good boy. Or is he? Is he? Theory. Sid is the evil one. Sid is the big bad evil. He's constructed this whole weave himself. Somehow he's able to survive in the blight. Very convenient. He wants to destroy the crystals. The very thing that oh, the whole world needs to survive. And he coerces Jill and Clive. Two susceptible, angsty, horny, I was going to say teenagers. Clive's like 25 at this point. Sid's evil. Calling it. This is all a front. No one's this good a boy. <laughs> Which is why we live in a cave. And it's also why we need help. From Brandy who know one end of a sword from the other. <clears throat> what say you, Clive? Will you join us? I am. Go on. Sid, was it? I trust that you'll do right by Jill. Oh, he's bouncing. Until my brother is avenged. I must walk my own path. Avenged? Yeah, how do my you plan on... brother was murdered. But he hasn't really connected it with Sambreek. I, I'm amazed that Clive in his ten years hasn't gone on a murder spree or Sambreek. Like, yeah. It was their shit that's all started this stuff really but he's all on all, all on the dark for it but damn man the branding of the face that's such a potent thing right your face is your most key part of your identity every time you look in the mirror just reminded it's heavy stuff by a second dominant of fire the phoenix is evil swing oh bugger me Evil Twin Theory! Evil Twin Theory confirmed! <laughs> I mean, the way he could be saying that in some odd context. 
I even started thinking, right, so we've got the Cain and Abel story. They were like twins. One of them was branded with a dog. Cain. Cain. That's where canine comes from. It's apparently, it comes from the Bible. Because Cain had the first dog in biblical history. So I had the evil twin there. But I don't know. I mean, I started thinking like, it's Joshua, my hooded guy. No spoilers. All speculation. But is, is it Josh? Is it an evil twin? Is it a shadow archetype? A rumor proven true. I only stand here today because of Joshua. Is the evil twin literal or figurative? I've waited man. for this chance. I All hypothetical questions. Junk from a gutter killed more men than I can count. You're right. The Empire will not suffer a deserter. This will be my best opportunity. My last. Which is why you should join us. I, am. I told you I'm not interested, I know. Clive's about as low as it gets right now. One of my scouts sent word there's a group of branded fugitives north of here in the Imperial village of Lost Wing. Among them is one he believes to be a dominant of fire. Oh. Is he certain? What say we go and ask him? This doesn't mean I'm joining you. Sid could be leading us along. He could be. He could be leading us. That's my ready then. You really know our Final Fantasy protagonists have evolved. You'll find everything you I need. I slept in. I slept in piss and shit. I I'll drank from the from the fucking gutter. There. <laughs> oh, Junbun. Purple Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, Jim. Much appreciated. And all the followers. And Clay, Cloud KJ for the uh, the Schmeckies as well, the Orange. This is England. Well, Jim, absolute legend. It's so good to see Jim Bun. He's still here from Elden Ring. For a minute, I thought Jim might be just uh, an Elden junkie. Never to be seen again. But no. It's Dear Jim, downstairs. Thank you Trying so much. Go off. All right, visit the main hall. We got any more active lore? I want all of it. Second icon of fire. Here we go. A fire aspect, aspected icon that first emerged in the year of the realm 860 when Imperial forces attacked the Vizarian stronghold of Phoenix Gate, clad in infernal flame. The fiendish creature flanked itself against the Phoenix, overpowering strength four. So, uh, for anyone who hasn't seen my theories, 860 in the Bible was when a uh, city called Jokthil fell. Jokthil. It was during the uh, war of uh, the warring tribes of Israel, and it was written in the book of Joshua. And Jokthil was set ablaze in this uh, battle between two rival nations. And weirdly, one of the things that started the battle was um, a, uh, a, a marriage that happened outside of the tribes, which was seen by some of them as like betraying your tribe. So then you've got like Clive's mother going over to the Holy Empire. Very much fits that exact day. And then we also found out that the goddess in Sambrique is called Grigor, which uh, is Greek for Gregorius. And that was also 1500 years ago, um, which is when this, the forebearers fell in this game. The timelines are fitting. They're fitting. A person with the power to cast magics, of Elysium, men and women uh, awaken as bearers are enslaved. Still wonder if Torgal is one, magical bork, a cheap alternative for the scarce of precious shards. This system of slavery has persisted for centuries and has become so ingrained in Valisian life that few take pity upon the bearer's blight, seeing as less than human. Ah, that's the messed up thing about slavery, right? It was cult culturally normalized, most people are blind to it. I would like to think if I was back then, I would have been different. But the realistic truth is most of us wouldn't. But yeah, they can also mine crystals and, and use them. But I guess as they start dwindling, the pressure on bearer slaves is going to get much, much higher, much more severe. Mm. 
Uh, has the chat frozen again? So, someone, somebody give me a ding ding. Somebody's have typed something saucy. Or just type saucy. Pico man. Torin Biri Biri. Hello. <laughs> Torin Bibi. My takeaway delivery service is spamming me with temptations. Empanaditas? <laughs> oh no. Go towards it. Perhaps you can Ems. help. Sid asked me to make ready for our mission. How does one go about that here? Uh, well, uh, there's old Nan's place. <laughs> old Nan? Oh, oh, uh, on second thoughts, uh, you maybe want to see Blackthorn first. Blacksmith. <clears throat> to the forge it is then. Oh wait, no, hold up. You'll be needing this. Blackthorn won't take no notice of you otherwise. Might not anyway. Uh, Blackthorn's the smithy guy with a mushed up face. Oh. Forge is down the end. Just follow the sound of Blackthorn's hammer. <clears throat> Forge is down the end. Just follow the sound of Blackthorn's hammer. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> I want to voice that guy. Also, Square Enix, if anyone from Square Enix is watching this, hurry up and give me a voice acting already. Freaking Sphere Hunter, she just landed a voice acting gig on uh, Cyberpunk. And now I've just found out, Yong Ye, he's voicing, uh, is it Kazuya? In, in freaking Yakuza. What the hell, man? Yong Ye is even landing voice acting gigs. Where, where's my square? Come on. What about F F Final Fantasy IX Remake? I could do a damn good... Oh, oh, soft. It's definitely how Zidane said it. Are you black? Please give me a roll. What if I am? Well, well, I could do a good, good queener. I'm not here to talk. I'll be accompanying Sid to Lost Wing and I'll just sit to in life. The things you eat and know. Accompanying the goddess Grieger to our holy bedchamber for all I care. I'm not lifting a finger for you. Is that so? <laughs> what an arsehole. A noisome, a noisome spirit. What does that mean? Suited to stripping oil from a painter's canvas <laughs> when consumption. Grants overworked conscripts a few rare moments of sweet oblivion, oblivion on their long, arduous sea journeys north of Compton. Man, being on a ship back in those days. Absolute hell. Nothing worse. Do you want that or not? The, I can take it not, back. There's not a crazy hobo in this game for you to voice. Damn you, goots. There will be one. All right, all right. No need to be hasty. Let's have a look at you. Did you step my penis? <laughs> I doubt that lock has stay a Moogle's fart. <laughs> Bloody Imperials. They'd rather see their bearers dead than kid it out properly. I'll do what I can, as a favour to Goot's mind. Get up, Goots. Yay, we're getting armoured because of Gooch. Thank you, sir. Um, I'm about more leather than I am. Sort of um, improvement. Um, so as well as no healing, should I also go butt naked? But naked, no healing. Palestinian man. Caesar Square. You want anything else? You bring your own materials. I'll bear that in mind. Thank you. Uh, a word of advice: Don't let Sid decide what's best for you. Man, th th that's for you know casual NPC dialogues. The old back, back and forth shots. Which is notoriously the derpiest section in any video game. Uh, they just look bugging, pretty janky. This is looking. It's good. It is very up to par. Um, so this change on the hideaway, a nurse will appear in the other one. I suppose I should think good. Make it quick. Make it quick. Very, very quick. 
But I ain't the cook, am I? <laughs> no, oh, shit, there's some, there's some reading. Uh, if you've tasted Kenneth's brown, I no. might as well be. Sydney is Smith and I need a smithy. Call it a marriage of convenience. Doesn't hurt that the forge is the hottest this side of hell, or that it works without magic. I won't have no bearer. Suffering for me. You got anything needs repairing? I got anything that needs repairing or restoring. You bring it here along with your own materials. Any scraps? So, would it be? <laughs> Do you love or hate your anything job, else? No! Man, I guess weed weren't invented back in 860. He needs a spleegum. The gift worked. You have my thanks. I, uh, <laughs> Come on, nearly there. Yeah, if, I, if I'm missing anything in chat, guys, I, I will take like little momentary pauses. Um, I'm just so engrossed right now. Oh, she's already uh, burned her brand off. You, blankets, quick as you like. Right, that's not tear mat, is it? No, it's a different dude. All right, we make him comfortable while the bed's made up. Well. You're just gonna stand there, some old face some water. I'll get the bucket. You go and see if Otto needs out, yeah? Yeah. Wait, me? This big guy is... I don't know if I like him yet, he's kind of breaking. He's breaking the immersion a little bit. <laughs> I don't know. But usually this is the most boring section of the game. You have your exciting open, and then you have your huge waves of dialogue and your base and the setup. Uh, I'm pretty goddamn engrossed. <laughs> hey, no, this way with stream man. Oh, well. I'm doing good, man. Good day. Huh? Can't wait to. They're freed Imperial bearers. Toggle motion. Who the hell are you? Can't you do it already? Was ah! that patch still to come? Shit, at this rate, you won't make it through the night. Think you can find your way up them stairs to the infirmary? We need tire. Well, go on. Shift your ass. <laughs> Shift your narrow beer. What? You what, Jeff? I'm, I'm done. I'm so pissed. All right, my landlord's getting a, I'm, he's, get, he's getting a call. I'm doing a stressy call. You son of a bitch. You told me, like, fifty percent above average price of Colombian places because you said it was solid. You dick cheese. You've, you've derped sixteen for me twice now. Unforgive a bibble. What does this mean? This is usually an internet thing. Come on. Come on. Why are you doing this? Right. Got a network. I'm gonna let that. Well, I'm gonna quickly go pee. Um, can I enable offload offline mode for this? How do you do that? Sometimes chat is gonna quickly. So I can calm down. 
Does anyone like a brew? One brew! Alright, this... This is better not have kicked me out of my progress. <laughs> Bree! You've got to come out sooner. I can't wait five days. Five days of potentially sabotage streams. Anyway, if there anyone, let me know in the comment section. If this is the first Pez stream you've ever watched. Um, <sighs> I'm a professional. How do I act like offline mode? And how does one activate offline? I thought you can play games offline. Well, it's, the, it's the licensing, right? Does it need a constant internet connection for the license? Like what? <laughs> what do you want from me? This is the first Final Fantasy I've ever watched with you. Matt! Nice! Uh, maybe log out and back in, reconnect to that work. Wait, is that, is that the way to do it? It's telling me. Uh, what do I do? Anyone who isn't an old boomer bitch? Yes, I know settings user accounts. I know. I don't know. Well, I forgot. That's it. What for me? What's the fastest way to do this? Go back in. Right. Yeah, anything else? Oh, games will we'll be closed! No! Wait, wait, wait. Is there an auto save happening? <laughs> Is that not. <laughs> yeah. Let's do my Sweden. <laughs> but I did see you get your butt beat all by the elderly bosses. I didn't use summons! I didn't use summons! Wait, who's missing? Is Bree. Reset. Oh, man. What? Bree, you can't. Why are you missing? Uh, what? <laughs> Reset. It, uh, it will be auto saved. Okay, we're trusting Bree. We're trusting Bree. <sighs> Swear to God. If I open back up on Jill, give me a spanked body. Longest second in history. Do I have to restore the licenses, like? Or can't I... Can I not just... <laughs> switch the game into offline? Restoring. Okay, and it won't be six minutes. Ah, oh, that's right, that's right. Patience. It'll be what it'll be. So what is a license? What is a PS5? What's the internet? How does any of this work? <laughs> are there any poor souls who are watching this stream because you're looking, living vicariously through my playthrough and other people's playthroughs because you do not yet have a PlayStation 5? <clears throat> Try changing the DNS settings. Man, I'll, I'll end up revealing my IP address or something. I'll get hacked. That's nah, so right. Once I've uh, at the moment, I'm running wireless. Four more days. Four more days. If the streams get much more interrupted. I'll just wait until the fourth day. But honestly, I'm already itchy that everyone else is <laughs> like chonking. They're mad chonking through this playthrough. Oh God. The ending is already out there, right? 
No, of course, no spoilers about it, but does anyone in this chat know about the ending? Don't say a thing, that's just a simple yes or no. Or has no one seen it yet? Oh my gosh. Final Fantasy endings are just about the most poignant thing in my entire existence. Why are you fuck? <laughs> I'm stored nice, I says. What? What does it want from me? Just, just leave that somewhere. I'm making a nice brew and it's a happy day. Well, I had 16 here. Ain't nothing gonna break my stride. Ain't no buddy gonna. Hold me down. Oh no. I just want to keep on gaming. <laughs> Fucking come on. I'm gonna hit my penis. <sighs> what do I do? Deep breaths, pairs, okay. Let's do a little bit of cheer. Fuck it! Ah! Why? <laughs> what? I've got an Ethernet connected. The wired LAN too. How could that be failing when I'm still on the stream? My jimmies are rustled. My jimmies are rustled. Okay, all right, let's check in again. Come on, mate. Try what Slippery said. Account, other enable. All right. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Thank you, guys. You're saving me. This is not what I wanted for my first 16 playthrough. Um, also sharing an offline play, right? What well, well, this? Don't enable or enable. You want to enable console sharing? Yeah. Enable, okay. Enable it, right? Roger. Roger. Tiamat, Ivan, PS. Gibbs. We don't know, not like a nice chamomile tea. Wait, does it seem darker in here than it was a moment ago? Maybe there's a storm brewing. Winds in the east, mist setting in. Something is brewing. It's gonna be a coffee. <clears throat> I'm so, I'm, this kettle, this is how my soul feels. This is how my soul feels. Oh God, I bet that was shrill. <laughs> oh, watching enabling. Um, I, I'm hurting inside. This, this game is so immersive, so juicy, so juicy, sweet. And even the most minor breakaway from it is, why is it still enabling? Okay, we go, what we got, can't care. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. There might have been a problem here. Okay, now. <laughs> really? You, 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 you're going to do this to me. I, I was able to play the demo. I mean, this shit's going to work. I, I, I can't fathom. Surely there's a way to just play it offline, right? You're not supposed to need internet. This is what Yoshi P told me. <laughs> right. 
What, 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 do, I, what do I do? Let me, let me just reconnect the ethernet. I don't know if that's gonna do a thing. If not, I'm gonna go for the old classic Pez tech resolution route, which is start smashing. I'm gonna start getting real smashy. <coughs> I would try restarting the PlayStation. Really, man? Nah, if I do, there's every possibility that if I do that, the stream will die. Oh, in their connection, connected. Oh, I'll well, test this. Have a brew. <laughs> Bleeding egg, I mean. If this persists much longer, I'm going to have a, uh, a Joker moment. This will be how the next Joker gets made. When a fanboy gets denied his... <laughs> oh! Now I've lost my spoon. I think I, f I threw my spoon in anger. <laughs> Where's my spoon? Oh, my spoon's here. Right. There's a network signing. So I have internet. I have internet connection. I have it. It's just not doing PlayStation signing. <laughs> it appears. The internet is dominating you, Pez. <sighs> Lag to boss. It is no coincidence that the worst internet I ever had, the worst crash I ever had, was after 100 hours of Persona 5 playthrough. I got to the end, and it was Yao de boss. And forever it's haunted me, Lag to boss. Whenever this <laughs> Pez and Lag to boss. <laughs> and now to think that I'm theorizing. And I have been doing a lot of Gnostic theories on Yao de Bath. And now we're back here. This is some Demiurge bullshit. <laughs> the Demiurge is coming for me! Um, okay. Uh, well, should I just, just, just re reset? Um, but I absolutely need to have interwebs. Right? I need, to, I need internet. What happens if you press the three horizontal lines of the game? Oh, you mean down? Oh, you mean here? <laughs> Select, unfollow. Not much. Um, Oh, wait, now it's working. Well, where are we back to? Where are we back to? Oh, yeah, yeah, Peter. I think I may have blown the lights on my on the apartment. Oh, there we go. That was weird. <laughs> okay, yay. Victory or death. All right, quick brew, quick brew, and then we go. What have you had for breakfast this morning, guys? I don't know, what, what, what time is it? Where are you all heralding from? We've got 100 homies in the house. How international are we right now? We've got any Stallions? Anyone from the soggy Isle of my homeland? We've got just shitloads of Americans. America, America. <clears throat> I was gonna say thank you, America. I feel like our teamwork together, you know, subjugating half the world and massacring millions of indigenous populations. That's really what, that's the reason why we have English voice acted Final Fantasy right now. 
and is only lip synced in English. Think about if you guys hadn't gone and nicked all of America and we hadn't colonized. Imagine if the Chinese had done it or the Russians. This would be a Chinese or Russian game right now. Cheers to us, guys. <laughs> we got UK in the house. We got USA. We got Philly. To take issues putting this man in goblin mode. <laughs> oh, I hate how well Bree knows me. <laughs> when I get a bit pissed, I turn oh, into a. I turn into a curmudgeon. Is it the same dialogue? Who are they? Huh? Uh, They're freed imperial bearers. Who are you? Right, I've listened to, I've listened to your nonsense already, sir. Was right, Tai the one looking after Jill? Right, Let's go speak with Tarja. Oh, I can't wait for this reunion between Jill and Clive. This is gonna feel good. Ah, I'm so ready to get my hopeless romantic on, man. I'm so ready. Your friend needs her rest. There'll be time for tearful reunions when she's recovered. So she's I'm burned her jail. brand. You're wanted downstairs. There are injured bearers in need of attention. Well, why didn't you say so? <sighs> I did say so. <laughs> we got Morocco in the house. I like Morocco. I had waffles and eggs with syrup all over it. Oh. That's, that's jank, man. That's real jank. Sweet eggs. Pfft. Makes me shiver, man. Gross. He's going to be all right. But that I need is to worse than syrup and bacon. Me. My work's just begun. Uh huh, uh huh. Get to it then. <clears throat> oh, I can't wait until we open, we get into our first environment. Let's Another go. fine day at the hideaway. <clears throat> Do many of the bearers who come here arrive in this state? It's no easy thing, casting off your chains. By the time most pluck up the courage, they're already too far gone. These two here are the lucky ones. Oh, the chat Otto. frozen again. You need anything? You ask me. Well, Good town. I do need some supplies. Do you now? Then Lady Karen over there will be <sighs> more than happy to help you. <laughs> right. They've, they've made a stroppy, oh. short-haired woman called and Karen thanks. for a reason. We Come see. on, Yoshi. Not we likely. see what you're doing. I won't be staying. Is that right? Well, for as long as you are here, consider yourself welcome. You helped us today. And we won't forget it. Well, we won't forget it. I had to get to work, Pez. Uh, 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 Moogle magic. The power of my hoboish bonds. Alright, quest. Keep an eye out for the green. Always keep an eye out for the green. Quest priority. New hideaway features. Oh, a thousand times. An ever growing compendium of, of all things Valestia. Jukebox. Alright, to do priorities, to do list. Yep, 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 yep. Who are these people? Come on, stream. <laughs> there we go. I don't know why this stream chat keeps uh, stalling out. It's most. most aggravating. Alright, hello, Otto. Chief Steward of Sid's Hideaway, who manages the day-to-day -day running of the operation in his friend's stead. So often, Sid often being taken far and away in his bearer liberating activities, even when Sid is at home, he prefers to leave such busy work to our home. So this is the man. He's the man. I need supplies for my journey to Lost Wing. Otto said you could provide them. What's that? Does the newcomer think it proper to make demands of a poor old matron before even introducing himself? It's Clive. Well, Clive, I hear that dog is yours. Since he followed Sid home one night, you I've seen him with his chins rubbed and his belly fed. Though I suppose that's your job now. 
Unless you lose him again. I won't. Not That's again. a dark thing to say. You know how we lost Thank you for watching Torgal? Him. Our so, homeland was burned. Were you going to buy something? Woman. What? We were enslaved. You didn't think I'd shower your lordship with my hard won wares while you swagger about with a pocket full <coughs> of gill? Life doesn't work that way, lad. Now, let's I like see you. some coin. Does anyone have a Karen in their life? A Charon? Both consumable items and gears can be purchased. Yes, thank you. Broadsword. See, do I want the upgrade? I'm going to be poor in this game. I am both a peasant in channel name and a peasant IRL. And usually in-game currency as well. But I'm going to run low-end gear because I want to die numerous That's times. Awesome. I want well, you all to go. Ha <laughs> ha! you died. No, I didn't die once in my playthrough. You fucking it suck. Now. And after all I've done for you. All right. It takes a second. Don't all worry about right. It. I can make an exception. But just this once, mind. My stores are getting cluttered, and I need to make room for the next shipment. Was Torgo asking to piss up the magical rock? Thank you. Thank me? Thank your dog. Cheers, cheers, Torgo. Oh, he's so pretty, he's so pretty. Oh, I've only had wee dogs growing up. My next dog, mine and Bree's dog. We're gonna, we're gonna get the wolfiest thing possible. I know. What, what dog would suit a peasant really well? I'm split between just getting more doges, Shebas for life, or maybe a Samoid. Huskies are a bit too much, man. Or um, maybe an English sheepdog. Those things are huge. My uncle had one. It could stand on its back legs and it could look over. It was like a eight and a half, nearly nine foot wall. <laughs> look what the curl dragged in. If you're look, gonna buy some, it'd be look, quick about it. The what dragged in? The curl? The, yes. the churl? What? Taking an interest, are you? <laughs> Wondering why such a Comely cultured lady would cast a lot with this rabble because he's got a special arrangement with the rabble rouser, that's why. Oh, special arrangement. Oh. Sids and old ladies, a scra I scratch Sids back and he scratches mine. Use me old trading connections, bring him whatever, even his little band need, and they pay what I ask. The deal. He's giving me Omir, far from the prying eyes of those who wish me ill, and there's no shortage of them, you believe. Believe me, I, I can't believe you. So whatever you want from them bags over there, but leave the bags. <laughs> leave the bags. Man, I ain't leaving no bags. They cost 5p now. That's when I knew society was going downhill. I started having to pay 5p for shopping bags. Is that come for anyone else's country or is that just another UK? one of said strays? What? Oh, we all are. Little ones, big ones, <coughs> and everything in between. We're a damn sight better off here than out there. Is, uh, is Ben Star streaming this? By the way, is Togo Dog or Wolf? I think they actually specified he's a wolf. You another one of said strays? What? Oh, we all are. Little ones, <laughs> big ones, and everything in oh. between. So there's no multiple dialogue, it seems, at all in this game. Sid, Bud's told me. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Go on, go on. Damn it. We'll be needing more wood. But if I step away to fetch any, this lot will be down around our ears. <laughs> ah, you there. <laughs> so that's my gold hairline. <laughs> couldn't persuade you to fetch me some timber, could I? <laughs> yeah, they put Asmund Bald in. Fetch wood for the carpenter. Oh, I'd be happy to. I'd be happy to. Anyone else oh, part of that receding hairline crew? You'll be helping me and the hideaway both. Takes a lot of work to keep this place standing. <laughs> More than we can manage, if I'm honest. It certainly looks like you've got your hands. My dad has that exact I hair. Say that again. 
The Fallen knew their craft, make no mistake, but not even there. Wondering when it's going to come for me. Forever. That's why the walls need shoring up. Can't have the uh, vegetable patch crushed before our first harvest now, can we? <laughs> I mean... No, I suppose not. Is that the patch? All right, where can I find this wood? Behind? Ask over at the White Ants. They'll point you in the right direction. Thanks again. I really appreciate the help. It can't be the whole vegetable patch, but it's not enough for half a dozen people's salad. This this meagre, this meagre shit here. Uh, speak with Carpenter <clears throat> at the White A's. Oh. I'm gonna do every single, every single quest. This is a full, full run. 75 hours. 75 hours, if I, do you guys think I should do two and a half hour streams a day? Should I do longer, less? I don't know, how many days would you say it's like, not too long, but not too quick to finish it? I, I was kind of anticipating 20 to 25 days. <laughs> Sometimes Excuse we do me. a double stream towards the, the man end. man working over by the garden sent me to fetch some wood. Ah, uh, uh, that'll be Jeffrey, Master Carpenter. Luck isn't that Jeff? We've just finished I want to see the these after. good you side quests. You take as much as you need from the stack. Thank you. Yoshi P has promised no, me... We appreciate the assistance. Is that Final Fantasy... 16 is good side quests. No collecting of toads. No traps that make you want to rip your fucking hair out. Do you think we should go and help? Don't think you're in. First round's on the ass. If you can read, don't let Otto know. We'll put you to work on the ledgers too. <laughs> Uh, is this the uh, serving food quest? I think, it, I think it might be. Ah, a new face. And, dare I hope, a willing pair of hands. The fat chocobo is a demanding mistress, and we are too few to keep her on her feet. Might I persuade you to deliver a meal or two to souls in need of sustenance? For your mm. trouble, I can offer you the contents of my strongbox and my enduring gratitude. Hello, Chris TV. You're loving the game so far. Yes. Help keep the fat choke by running. Go on then. I don't see why not. Wait, did it say 500 gold exactly was going to be I my, the honor of my reward? Clive. Delighted to make your acquaintance, Clive. I'm it's Kenneth, too much money. and mine are the weary shoulders upon which the weight of this fine establishment rests. Now, Hello, I have Kenneth. three hungry customers awaiting their victuals. Take these if you would, and be careful, they're hot. You're a very well-spoken chef. Ooh. Oh, meal. Oh. Oh. Here's your, well, here's your slot. Sits up there in that hole of his, brooding and scheming. Oh. Lay off Happy bloody <clears throat> Yeah. Oh. My thanks. <laughs> I hope you do not think me lazy for waiting to be served like a lord. This is the one <laughs> irrelevant side quest I'm willing to tolerate. Kindly, you see, because you left me half lame, truth be told. But see, it's, 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 it's setting up. It's setting up the slavery. <laughs> uh, Angle. The hideaway is the home I never knew, and a mighty fine one at that. We've got any good chefs in the house. Rate your chefery out of 13. Between me and Bree, I'm definitely the better, more proficient cook. Just waiting for her objection in three, two, one. Your food. I was hoping it might be. Yep, there it well, is. Well, doesn't this look fine? Thank you, lad. Bree only knows how to cook you're rice. You're new, aren't you? 
Kenneth's running you ragged already, I expect. The old rascal. Old oh, rascal. And even then, she only knows how to turn on a, a rice cooker. She had no idea how to cook Sorry, rice outside short. of a rice cooker. We're not slaves anymore. Well met, lad. And keep up the good work. She's had a rice cooker her whole life. Now, if that ain't white privilege, yeah, I don't know what is. The retreat once Titan turned up. <clears throat> right. Who's, who wants their last bowl of slop? Let's click. Oh, there's a guy up here. There you go, book man. Well, well. There's so much more to farming than just seeds and soil. Uh, your food. Just a moment. I need to finish this. <coughs> it be a burden. I'm of no use to anyone as I am, but maybe if I can master this. All right, but see that you eat it before it gets cold. Of course. Thank you. This game could be a turning point for Square Enix if done right. So I mean, visually and world building, it's all there. It, it really just depends how the story arcs out from here. Uh, Mihiro is the main story writer. And um, yeah, like I feel very confident with him. He wrote a lot of the Evilly stuff, which was fantastic. He also wrote uh, ARR. Uh, it may have been Heaven's Ward. Um, ARR, obviously not the strongest storytelling, he wasn't there, oh no, he did Stormblood as well actually, I think, which also wasn't the strongest, I mean, Stormblood was good, but not, not top tier, like uh, Heaven's Ward and Endwalkers, I'm sure I've played Endwalkers, um, so I'm just hoping Mihiro is, he's up to Heaven's Ward at least, Yours is telling. not a familiar face. Are you new to the high If he is, chance? you could say that. Well then, allow me to then welcome we're in you. for a treat. I am Hippocrates the Second Hyperboreus. That's uh... <laughs> quite a mouthful, I know. What Which is why everyone here has taken to calling me simply Tones. Was that Hyperboreus? Company I keep, and what varied company? I am a collector, you see. Not of bijou and baubles, but of stories. The history and culture of these isles have ever been a source of endless fascination to me. But alas, my days of wandering the realm in search of new tales are far behind me. And so I've taken to sharing that which I've gathered with all who might listen. Perhaps you would care to listen. So, so he said, Harpocrates Hyperboreus, right? Because... I spoke about that ironically just the other day. Seven remake, or uh, well, Far Fight Seven, Hyperborea. It was like the Greeks believed that there was like a magical land and shit, and the Nazis picked up this uh, tale of Hyperborea um, out in the north, in Antarctica and stuff. That there was a magical race. It's what the Cetra were based on, but also Hippocrates. Hippocrates, Greek as well. No coincidence, guys that most of my theories have been circulating down how Greek was merged into Christianity. And even in the latest uh, 16, you know that arty, artsy-fartsy little trailer that they did? It's kind of like, past, like pastel drawing or something. They had like a, a dude when some Greek was burning, holding what was old classic like Greek symbol. So the fact that they have Greek-based dudes telling us the lore, that's so on theme for all my theories have been about Greek in like the base of it but how the Christians uh, evolved that out and I think that's what we're seeing in 16 I guess like the old old cosmogony stuff is kind of like Greekish that's why we have like um, Typhon and stuff in this game and then the new cultures like Sambric and Rosaria are Kind of like Christian and Catholics. I think we're seeing, like, that's kind of what this is based on. And it's like kind of the same point in human history where it was that transition from the, uh, <clears throat> like the old, old world to uh, the biblical phase. Um, do you know the thousand times? Yes, please. I have compiled some new entries. Right. If you would like to see them, 
it's just so cool that I, have a few I was able to view notes that might interest oh. you. I was able to dissect this link. And it just feels like it's getting you more wish near. to study the tones. Uh, amateur analyst. I mean, <clears throat> we're all amateurs at first. It takes practice. Right, well, we, the Battle of uh, Nisa. Ah, okay, so this was a short yet bloody uh, clash in 873. Hope to be a force that end long in conflict with Iron Blood. Uh, the Kavina Council it was an initial stronghold and entreated their Woloda allies to aid them in their cause. However, talks soon broke down and the Mechans were left with no choice but to rely once again upon Titan. Mm. Ren Shiva. Maybe that was lost on both sides. Stalmech. Uh, yep. Opportunistic, Drake's Fang. Uh, oh, formed of ministers representing each of the states with the Prime Minister at his head. Yeah, so it does have a Prime Minister. It's the only one that isn't a monarchy in this. Um, I know you could say also Iron Blood. What is that? Is that a theocracy where it's religious? What, the Iron Kingdom? Uh, the highest council of government. Wow, there's a lot here. <laughs> uh, Hugo Cupco leverages power of the dominant titan to share the Republicans. Yep. Oh, this is Prime Minister. An old wizened ghoul. It's very fitting. Why do we why do we keep putting old wizened ghouls into positions of power? <laughs> this is fantasy Joe Biden. Leader of the Dalmechan Parliament and eldest and most experienced of its members. See, there's always this thing running that age equals experience and wisdom. I found that not to be the case. I found that most old people I know, they're not all the wiser for it. There is a point where you just start becoming dumber and more boneheaded, less flexible. And you need flexibility for leadership. Uh, plus the dominant time who serves as an official, as alas, Hugo Kupka does not, does not take kindly to his advice being ignored. Uh, his love for Benedict Harmon is absolute, and he would gladly betray his every ally just to be with her. I said it. I said it in my theory predict that I was getting a sense. Man, look at Hugo's jawline. It's, it's chunky. Um, I, I said I, I got a suspicion that Hugo actually does harbor an emotional connection for her. Oh. And part of my theory is that Benedict will either turn to stone in this game or she'll lose her sanity. And when Hugo's saying, You said I would be king of the world, it's, uh, it's because he's mourning her. That, that might not be right, that's just a theory, but this fits, this fits. Titan is a simp. <laughs> no, Titan and Hugo is just reflecting what happens in the real world. Women claim to be the uh, emotional, romantic, uh, connected ones in relationships, yet every time a breakup fucking happens, she moves on quick as fuck. It is dudes who fall into the holes of depression. Dudes emotionally attach so much stronger than women. Hot take? Was that cat? Is that cat? Was that? Is that based? Commander of the Kingdom of Wallows, elite intelligences. You sit by her liege's side at the highest table of state. Most recently, in the negotiations with Del Mex, uh, the Zenitra stronghold. Uh, but Barnabas is not the only one with whom she shares a special bond. Benedicta also has eyes and ambitions for Hugo. So she wants to raise him up. Interesting. She'd be calling both dudes king. The aloof and unshakable Barnabas armor, first of his name, if you can meet his steely gaze about flinching. Yeah, man, this is why you never take some back somebody who cheats. Just, just, just remember... In that moment, she was calling someone else daddy. <laughs> uh, Lord Commander Kira Willow's army accompanied his liege. Oh man, there's a lot here. Republic Damek to negotiate the provision of reinforcements and the rule order of the knights. Are you sleeping there, sir? Are you sleeping there? A lot of people have commented on his likeness to uh, Jill. I wonder if he's from the Northern Territories. Cool if he's a Northern territory -er. Even wild if he is related to Jill, but I doubt it. Maybe a cousin or something. I don't know, the plait, the hair. 
And obviously we also mistook this for Dion back in the day. Well, I certainly did. Because he kind of has very similar uh, clothing to Dion in terms of the frills, but this is medieval. The dudes were rocking frilly lace all day, every day. Oh, wow. <laughs> Shit, man, there's, there's so much here. Barren waste, bereft of people where no life stirs and magic is unstable. Um, the blight is spread even more widely. Yeah, leaving sign of devastation. The life force of the land and the source of all magic. Consumes depends on its strength for those manifesting potent forces over a wide area. Large schools can channel more ether than smaller ones, and thus can be used to cast more powerful magics. One might use a small ration shard to grill a fish, but require a large municipal crystal to fire a blacksmith's forge. <clears throat> Benedicta knows how to get a man. She's perfected the art. It's not that hard. Most dudes are pretty easy. <laughs> Sad but true. A realm comprising of twin continents of storm and ash, uh, of which the mother crystals stand timeless vigil. At the foot of each great city has risen up. Using me as a queen of blackness. Okay, I'm just going to skip through most of these. Uh, I do like all this lore. Well. Enormous glassy mountains. Five of which tower over the land. This was mother theory, guys. There were five dungeons in Gnosticism, each harboring one of Sophia, the, the, the mothers, the great goddess. Uh, the archons that rebelled. One of those archons was Typhon. The source of all crystals. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, Drake's breath. What's this? One of, one of Phallus's five remaining mother crystals. Oh! Oh, so the five mountains are also the same as. Uh, just classifies as what's remaining. Wait, so does, does Willowed not count? Wait, no, because we had seven. We had seven. Drake, Drake's eye is missing. So what, what is the uh, other one that? doesn't count. Is it? Is it well, loads of one because it's fallen to blight? It's a, it's a blighty crystal. Located on the route to the iron blood as bean. Bean? Oh, I really want beans. Oh, I really want beans. I'm a British man and I've been about two months without beans. I'm practically fucking dead. Beans are British people's ether. So I point out the orchestra to pairs. Oh, yeah, yeah, the orchestra thing. Yeah, they, I, see, I see that. We're going to go check that out. Though it's occupied. Uh, Trace the Duchy controlled the crystal was recently wrested from Zara's grip by the Crusade following a series of bitter conflicts. Crucifixes on their flags, man. This is cool stuff. Right, yeah, I think we've seen this. Wow. God, there's so. <laughs> there is a lot here. Basic information. So we've seen this. Uh, icons are told with each elemental affinity. It's commonly held that two icons of the same element cannot coexist. But as none has ever witnessed all of these rare creatures together, the conjecture is yet to be proved. Yep. Usually there's hundred. there can be hundreds of years between any uh, icon emerging. They just all happen to be born in the here and now. Person of interest. Might bring him be Oh, if you bring me a can of beans, Brie. <laughs> That's all I need. That's all I need. You can chuck all the other presents that you've got me in the trash. Um, just, just bring me beans. <laughs> Clio's personal state. Ah, oh, yeah. And bro's got twatted in the eye. Well, it's no good one-eyed chocobo. Put it down. Let's have some tendies tonight. Some ambrosia tendies. Saving him from certain death at the cost of an eye. Yeah. Ambrosia, isn't that kind of what ether was? Wasn't that uh, Ambrosia? Wasn't that one of the things that was in the Ark of the Ark of the Covenant? It was like a magical liquid that would. Yeah, you're grumpy. You're stupid. You're a bitch. You're pretty damn cool. I don't like you. Also, you're the man, Sid. You're so goddamn sexy. Benedict of that thought. Hugo, big muscly simp. Uh, definitely not sleep near. Um, hello, I'm actually Clive's uncle. Bork, Bork, magical Bork. Uh, Jill, Squee! Um, Joshua, is definitely not dead. Um, yep, that's everyone. Ah, Hyperboreo. Yeah, Hyperboreus. Hyperboreo was a magical land. Fascinating, fascinating. 
I love it. I will. We'll come back to this. Did you learn everything you needed? <clears throat> I'm a, am I now a, a slightly more advanced analyst? All done, I presume? Splendid. They were bearers. All three of them. Not slaves waiting upon their master's pleasure, but men waiting to be fed like equals. Indeed. Equality is the very cornerstone upon which our little community is founded. Beyond these walls, we are scorned as slaves. Speaking only when spoken to, eating only what scraps our masters deign to give us. The first hot meal here is the first many will have known. Immediately if I was in this world, you know how I'm getting rich. I'm setting myself up in this place as a tattooist. For sure! You come in and instead of burning, branding a freaking thing off your face and just getting a big old nasty like red patchy scar on your face, just just do tattoo fixes. Tell your own unique design, take back your own identity. Why has no one thought of that? Tattoo something over the top of that garish old mark. What would you ta what would you do guys? You have to have a big tattoo about this big on your face. Maybe I would like tattoo like um, uh, a Siamese twin. Make it look like I've got like a three-dimensional Siamese twin attached to my head. So I look like I've got two heads. Oh Brie would definitely get a big Pepe. <laughs> For sure, just big giant <laughs> an Apu. <laughs> In the hideaway, we are free. What would you go for, guys? Truly free to speak as we please, when we please, and to eat what and when we desire. More than reason enough to trust in Sid's vision, wouldn't you say? Now, <laughs> I promised you something for your trouble, did I not? The contents of my strongbox are yours to do with as you will. Wasn't Ambrosia the forbidden fruit Thank or Eden's you, apple? Oh, what's it? Me again. I know Ambro Ambrosia is something biblical. Else. The name of the food of the deities which gives eternal youth and immortality. This was conceived as something material, and ambrosia is not only food of the gods, but also the drink of the gods. Yes, but where did it appear? Oh, more Greek here as well. One of the Pleiades, the, uh, the daughter of Atlas. Oh, that's interesting. So, so Am Ambrosia had a... At Atlas was Greek, right? Is this another example of a Greek Christian? Mergeru. Uh, where was it from? I don't know. Yeah, the food or, or, or drink of the Greek gods. And then it ended up making its way into the Bible. Where do you think we should go and help? The iron blood were quick to sound the retreat once Titan turned up. Do these stairs go anywhere? It's so bloody dark. Careful, Can I see you? that? I've spent the old morning on these stairs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, broom wielding. Oh, he's, he's doing something on the stairs. <laughs> right, let's get some. Does this keep playing even when you're roaming around? Purchased from a vendor. Oh. Yeah, nice. I think he'd have time for nice. a nip with old August before scampering back to his solar, but no. Lonely, are we, August? Ooh. Oh, guys. Chills. Chills. <laughs> I know I'm playing 16, but I'm constantly having it dawn on me. I'm playing the next Make No Final Fantasy, man. Yeah, boy. Do you reckon 16 has just secured a big, long, glorious future for the franchise? Take, take some planes, all right? Here we are. I better get this to... Jeffrey, was it? <laughs> Coming, Jeff. 
<clears throat> Yo, 105 homies in the house. Woo! Has everyone hit that like button? What's the like button saying that? Whoa! Charon in Greek mythology ferries the souls. Yeah? The souls of the dead. So is, it, is that the same as the boatman? Was it, was it you know, in, uh, in Troy? You know, you stick two coins on, on their eyes and you pay the boatman? That's Charon. All Greek references, man. Sid once told me no, no, the no, doesn't kill the land. It only makes her forget what she wants. Wait. Oh, you're back. Did Hope that guy just say? It wasn't too much trouble. <laughs> I feel like he was actually saying something significant. I weren't taking in. <clears throat> will this be enough? This will do nicely, thank you. With a bit of luck, oh. the walls won't be falling in on us just yet. That sounds ominous. Pleiades. Oh, so I mean, yeah, that's a star system. And it's a right? damn sight better than the alternative. We're safe, we're warm, and we're hidden. What more could we ask for? Now stop Indeed. fretting and take this. You've earned it. Welcome to the fold. I look like that with my shirt. There's off. no need to. That's not a matter of need, my friend. You're one of us now. The Pleiades are the seven daughters of the Titan Atlas, and it's weird that in Waff, Lana and Ray also. Command them according to Tama. Gilbug. <laughs> Contrary to popular belief, this small insect does not get its name from its appearance, but rather from the fact it is highly sought after by psychers? Physicus? Psychers who use in brewing medicines. In uh, summer, when beetles are most numerous, children across the realm spend nigh every waking hour collecting specimens when it's receiving them from a handful of coppers. As children have tiny hands, however, this amounts to a few of them. <laughs> no one might expect. All right, they've not gone over overboard with the puns just yet. I do think they're warming up to it, though. Do that, do that, and these, these chickens are shoving me. Collect the supplies. All right, let's do it. This is a little beautiful piano piece. Does that normally activate? Is this a normal thing to happen? Or is Clive just is he the only one? Uh, this customizes a virtual battlescape. Provides Clive with a safe space. I don't need no training, I'm a fucking professional. Oh, I actually have to go in. God damn it. Channels was the name of the centaur that uh, mentored the Greek hero Hercules. Oh, what in the actual like story or in in the Disney? <laughs> yeah, to be honest, my body is more like his. If I'm honest. So did these guys even fight back? Can we get anything juicy in here? Wow, this is a pretty dope environment. Yeah? Crystals ha have never looked so. Good, yeah, yeah. Tasty, tasty. That's enough. All right, enough. Yeah, that, that is enough. I don't want any training. Get me out of here. I want to leave. Wait, do I do I have to fight these fuckers? Oh, end training. It was right there. <laughs> Photo mode. Oh, I'm able to get the right angles. Wait, has Clive got faces? Oh, what have we got going on? <laughs> oh, wow. Depth of field, focus, blur. I haven't unlocked some of that. Clive. No Clive. Okay. Right, we don't we don't have dumbass faces on Clive just yet. That's that's sad. We okay. Let me out! I'm trapped. I'm trapped like a rat in training. There we go. <laughs> 
Yeah, I don't need, I don't need any of that. I'm curious though. Can I? Um, all done. Can, can anyone else else do that? Mm. Probably anyone with magic. Leaving right? already? Ah, yeah. It's you I'll miss the most, Lady Karen. It always is. Don't stop you going, does it? This should be fun. Right. There's something going on between those two. <laughs> Clive's face just then. <laughs> oh, I love it. Their faces are great. Right, use the world map instantly to skip it back, boom, boom, boom. Anyone watching this stream right now, you're watching this while you've also got 16 open yourself. Right, fast travel, okay. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Right. Any other quest markers around? I think we're done. Make for the Great Woods. Let's go. I'm, I'm ready for some more combat. With no heels. There's a good girl. Hungry, are you? Uh, and then of these ambrosia? Does it... Wait, how long does a chocobo live? Spending this game or app in 15 minutes because license can't be verified. What? Why? Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Alright, let's go. To the great word. Before the stream crashes again. Boom. Alright, uh, so deep and vast is a great wood. Ah, it's cool, it's also got a little map of who owns it. We're going to Sambrique territory. It serves as a defensive barrier between the Crystal Belt and the Holy Empire. While its denizens deter, uh, deter foolhardy travellers from exploring the forest's everlasting night. Ooh. Right. Yeah, so those chains are national borders. It's pretty cool. <clears throat> so, uh, have any of you died in your 16 playthrough yet? Has <clears throat> anyone had a KO? A ripper rooney? Blood flies everywhere. I told you we should have taken the Crystal Road. And I told you we're outlaws. Well, you want every bounty hunter in Storm harrying us from here? To the holy capital. The sound of squeak out. What's wrong with the shortcut <laughs> through nature's <laughs> splendor? Get off. The Deadlands claim more of the realm each day. But a place like this still exists is a miracle in itself. Blood flies and all. We'll be <clears> back <throat> in Imperial land soon. You're all right. Never better. Six. Like Sid <laughs> <it. laughs> is such a great dude. I'm suspicious. That there is a fine hound. Soon took to hunting. Fearless as you like. It's good to have you back, Togo. Now, we don't want to be caught in the forest after nightfall. It makes me so I happy. Not. Where's that where's that bangle round his leg? Quiet, fanning embers. What is this? These are chapter names, right? This is a chapter three? Three on two? Hero's best friend. Togo has joined the party and will fight alongside Clive. Uh, shortcut, once, sit, yep, yep, wait up, yeah, well, I'm gonna pay him, right now. Cessie known as the Ring of Time Assistance. Did I mention there'd be deadly beasts? There'll be deadly beasts. Well, so at what point did the game ask me what difficulty I wanted to play in this reassuring. Did you just carry on from the demo? For that and the shortcut. Come here, boy. <laughs> this brings me so much joy. Am I going too fast for you? Yeah. God, I love an in-game forest. I feel like I was a beautiful, big-chested woodland nymph in a past life. 
this this feels more home than any home I've actually homed in. Oh. Oh. Damn, man. Do you feel that, guys? There's some magic. There's some magic happening right now. Oh my gosh. This is what I was worried about. Getting into a fight is going to... Let me jump on you, boys. Such squishy mobs. That's enough. I may need to remap because it's so hard to pull off some of these. Theme. Oh man. The atmospheric mu noises plus the music. All right? It's all just an amalgamation of greatness. We still have oh. a way to go. Oh. <laughs> yes, man. All right. All right, here we go. We've got a bit more law. Uh, occupying the northeastern regions um, with the great sea capital, Aura Flame. Uh, the largest theocracy and home to the Mother Crystal Drake's head under the rule of the Holy Empire, uh, Emperor, the people of Sambrik enjoy a life of plenty. Um, they believe to be a gift from the goddess Grigor herself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Which is also very cool. The image of the Virgin Mary, it looks like. It's very similar to. Uh, Clive's faithful friend, our boy. Uh, reunite 13 years later in the depths of the Nisa Defile. In the intervening years, Torgal not only grew into a fine hound, but met with Sid, who trained him. Okay. See, that seems like that happens separately then. Sid goes and helps bearers, and he just happens to be separately from everything, looking after Torgal. Torgal bearer confirmed. I, I have a bearer or people right, he's going to be an icon. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, that, that Grigor term, ah, I said earlier in the stream what that is, based on another Greek Christian intertwined sounding name. And yeah, he said that, well, well I looked into it, it was basically a long running name from like 1500 years, the exact uh, time scale of this game. I love this song. You think Grigor is an allusion to the Grigori, the fallen angels? It could be that as well. Could be that as well. Oh. Oh, we ain't gonna fight this thing yet. This thing goes into a little spin ball. Leaps around the arena. What in good Grieger's name is he doing this far south? Looking for food. No more walls where he's from. The north was one of the first parts of Storm to fall to the Blight. Oh, sod. I'd invite him over for a cup of tea if I didn't think he'd eat the dump. This makes me want to go out and just buy myself a full set of black leathers. When's armor plating going to come back into fashion? Wow, songs is keep evolving more and more. <laughs> Any only thing to mention this now. 
Ah, I got interrupted. I'm gonna try to just try to air juggle. Not this time. Oh, there you go. So you can get a few shots well, that's the underground to extend your airtime. That's, that's very cool. Kind of takes you out of danger just to lift an enemy up. So you can do multiple hits and shots. I wonder if you can pull four off midair. Probably will once you start getting ruders. Crazy airtime. After you. When are the mobs going to stop being tissue paper? Please. It's, it feels like when the mobs come up, it's just a time to get swanky and have fun with the combat system. There's no the ruins. actual threat of They're danger at all whatsoever. And that's sad. That is sad. But Some say there was a time they blocked out the stars. Hopefully the NG Plus Down is Down was the only way left for them to go. There's probably a lesson to be learned from that. But it can wait. Come on. Blocked out the stars. Suspending app in five minutes because I'm a cunt. Oh, oh, wow, Woohoohoo! Yeah, man. Oh. Last time I got a feeling like this in Final Fantasy, it was a random little spot. I had it with Vanille and Saz when we uh, first went to the, uh, what was it called? The woods. The old woods. We got a cool vista, but I mean that, that is... Wow. So looking at the ship that we get in this game, it kind of has that same layout. I wonder if the ship is using ancient tech. What was this ancient civilization? Seven remake on the plate after the plate collapses and look out over the slums, the red sky. I know. This has some of that natural world wonderment to it. Sunleth Waterscape. That's it. Yeah, Sunleth Waterscape. That's not to say we haven't had beautiful vistas in no, fifteen and seven and games since, but. Just that natural beauty or hits differently. Damn, that's nice. It's very nice. Use toggle pairs. Oh yeah. I mean, oh, I don't. I, I want toggle making stuff easier. In fact, how can I debilitate myself a bit? I'm not healing, but I want. I want to make it even harder. I'm gonna get myself naked. All right, let's take everything off. We're going butt naked. I'd take off my bloody sword and, and punch everything in the head if I could. Right. Arse to grass. Right. We've got, got 320. Um, so what's, what's really important for me to get early days? Uh, so that'll give me my double jump, which I kind of want. Uh, I'm going to slice down. I'm going to master the jump. Oh wait, no, this is all, is this all carried over? Oh shit, I charged the wrong thing. It's because I need to pee and I can't focus. Yo guys, I, I said I'd only be playing two and a half hours a day, but, um... I don't want to end. I don't want to end. Can I keep going? Can I keep going? Yeah, I don't want to keep going. I kind of want to carry on playing all day and all night and never sleep, ever.
I must admit, when I, when I look on at horizons like that, in my old age, as I've become an old peasant, I've started becoming a bit of a doomer. Bit of a doomer, prepper. I feel like I'm a couple of years away from standing on a street corner, tolling a bell, yelling about the end of days. That we're slowly moving into a technology dystopia, but all of a sudden, all of a sudden, it's all reconciled. Look how far we've come here. <laughs> yeah. Like, the, 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 the distance rendering of all of this is. It's actually still really good. Obviously, the trees are a little bit. Fuck! Fuck! Yo, that's really cool. They've. They've switched the front page to a forest. Are they dynamically updating? Fun. Wait, what? This is new? <laughs> I thought it would just tell me that. Oh, man. Well, why, why is it having issues with my licensing? Is this an internet thing? Was this. So, right, so, so how, I don't even know how I fixed it last time. It just seemed to just start working. What I, <laughs> I don't get why the licensing is breaking down. Uh, this was a user's accounts. Is this what fixed it? I try to enable this. <clears throat> I've, heard, I've read that the game is about 30 hours. Have you heard the same? Uh, 35 hours, Yoshi P said. Um, I'm a 70 hours completionist, which I would I would like it to be a little bit, a little bit more than that. You're telling me you couldn't have just squeaked in an extra 10 hours square? <laughs> you unfollowed it and then it worked. Wait, what do you mean I unfollowed it? When, 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 uh, when did I unf unfollow it? Internet again? No, I mean it was say it's not the internet. It was saying like fifteen minutes until I lost the freaking license or something. And it's got internet. It does have internet. Like whenever I do an internet check, it is fine. So, <sighs> my town lord. Hello, mate. Anyone watch back on Full Fantasy Fantasy? You may want to skip ahead from the timeline to when you see the game sign back up and me absolutely one hit crushing, naked, no heels. It's Adamant Easy Boss. <clears throat> it's definitely a network thing, and that this console is not a primary for your account, so it needs to be reconnected to the internet for it to work. Said issue is connected to PSN before. Well, how, I mean, how can my internet be cutting out? Because I wouldn't still be on stream. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> it doesn't make sense. And you selected the three dots. Yeah, I selected the three dots, but I didn't. I didn't. I didn't do anything. The three dots didn't have. Wait, wait, wait. Cause I, Someone be clear. Are you saying that I unfollowed? What did I unfollow? Did I actually press that? <laughs> no, unfollow is just like following whether or not you get like updates or some shit, right? I didn't actually do anything. It, it, honestly, it just started working it by itself. Maybe restarting the console will help. <sighs> yeah, I mean, that. that Ah, a humbug. <laughs> That's right. So yeah, the uh, that little section in the base um, feels a bit stuffy. Pace has slowed a smidge, but it's still very cool. The visual splendor. The glorious music just makes up for everything. I don't know if I'm liking some of these characters in the base. Uh, yeah, why, why is it connect, not connected to the PlayStation Network? What is that? What is that? Surely, uh, surely I don't need... Yoshi P said you don't need an internet connection. So how do I just play Final Fantasy 16 in offline mode? 
Why is it constantly trying to validate the license? What is this bullshit? Play it offline mode. Where is it? How? Should I just reset my PlayStation? Um, oh yeah, we all, we all, we all do it. We all do it. Good night, sweet prince. <laughs> but yeah, already just uh, a few couple of hours in to the stream, and um, a lot of cool references. I can't wait to finish the game and start road mapping all of uh, the various references. But they are just dunking us with. Oh. You guys can see that PlayStation logo, right? Seems like it's working. When you're connected again, enable offline play. How does one enable offline play? Is that something when you uh, open the game, you play play offline? How do you, how do, you do that? Is it manage content? How do I play this bad boy offline? Yes. Oh, this chat is so delayed. <clears throat> Otherwise, try this. Go to settings, users, accounts, console sharing offline. Enable. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I tried to do that, didn't I? And it, it didn't. It didn't do anything. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, mate. I'll go try it again. One mate. You know what, the Airbnb guy that I've rented this apartment from, he he's literally gone incognito. I've ripped the fridge out of the fucking wall because that thing was just going meh, meh. He's like, he asked me if everything's okay and I told him the internet weren't stable enough and that, that was making a noise and then he just dipped. You, sir, are going to get wrecked on Airbnb, sir. I'm going to destroy you. <laughs> Why, man? How, how is that just for turning offline mode? I, I need the internet to go into offline mode. How does one just go into offline? No, I'm done for fucking said just asking the chat. You know, I'm just going to see Poxy well look at it. How to play offline PS5. Because I swear to God, if you need internet to play offline, that is the most ass backwards thing. You do! Go to settings, use an account, console sharing offline play. Select enable or disable. You need to connect. You need to connect to the server to switch something into offline mode. Where the fuck is the sense of that? Where is the sense? Is your account logged into multiple consoles pairs? So I've got Bree's account on here. <laughs> it's not it's not somehow conflicting, is it? It needs to connect initially. Well that's that's some dumb shit. But I've got internet, that's the thing. A good internet. Maybe maybe I need to sign in my PlayStation account or something. I mean that's just some fucking dumb, dumb, dumb bullshit. Uh, screw this, I'm just going to wildcard it. Come on, work for me, work for me, please. Yes, thank you, nice, sweet. To the wood, to the woods we go. Oh, happy day. Oh, it's actually worked. Wow. wow. God, oh, look at those loading times. Look at those loading times. <laughs> me, oh my. Um, well, anyway, after this stream, guys, I'm going to... Oh, I'll, I'll research into it and try to suss it. Thank you so much for sticking with the streams, guys. <laughs> Despite these issues, I definitely would have dipped, so you're a better person than I. Oh, a wee little rival. A wyvern. I can see that. It doesn't have to be a friend of yours, does it? <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> 
Ah, I got the big explosion, nice. Oh, what? Oh, I thought I was charging my blade. No. Great music, yo. Is Yoshi P our hero? Or is it actually, is it actually so good? Hi. He jumps out, cheeky boy. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Easy yeah. day. Can we do much damage then? <laughs> oh yeah, I should be using Torgle, right? Sick of Torgle. Come on, boy. Sick of boy! Man, these mobs are so crusty. You lose. Woohoo! It's so fun, though. It's so fun. I just wish there was more uh, more meat to these mobs, man. I need to go to PSN account website and remove the other PlayStation device and set this one as his primary. It'll stop the licensing issue. Bloodhound Lord, thank you for that, mate. Yeah, I was uh, playing on Bree's account for all of Elden Ring. She already had it, and I never found it. Shelling out extra schmeckles. Uh, upon close inspection of a lesser dragon's foot, one might observe that the middle talon is considerably longer than the rest. This extended appendage used to punch the fleshy parts of the prey. Uh, yeah, okay. uh, if there's one thing that the fawn of Valisir do not want, it is more dagger sharp fangs to lie in their slathering moors. Okay. For some reason, Siri has responded to slathering moors. It's now trying to look up slathering moors for me. Oh, it's actually showing me a picture of Hillary Clinton. Oh, that makes sense. Uh, succumb to said fangs have conceived ingenious ways of fashioning them into a myriad articles of vertu. Interesting. Oh, yeah, so, uh, oh. oh, guys, I don't want to sign out. I don't want to sign out. I may Must have to at some point. Though. Keep your eyes open. Oh, that vista keeps killing me. Oh, wow. Now, that's a wall run. None of that slow shuffling nonsense. Well, Clive just led me. We won't be going this way. <sighs> I'll admit, I hadn't counted on that. <clears throat> Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, I would have got the uh, chat bar open, guys, so we could uh, we could have had some what damn it, boys. But I didn't want anything to overload the uh, the computer. Why trust in your own animus thing when you have an actual animal at your side? If you are lost, hold down L three and let tool you in the right direction. Yeah, curious. Clive's got animal instinct. At least one of us knows these woods. Thank you, Toggle. I haven't given Toggle a snack in a while. Oh, man, what's the name of this song? It's all about combos. Wait till late game, Lopez. You'll know. Yes. <coughs> yeah, I mean... We are still at the stage in Final Fantasy where usually we would just be doing attack and, and fire or thunder. Steel. <laughs> Compared to where this would be if this was turn-based. Um... Well, 
too happy. Lampions is not my fault. That's enough. You're finished. That ball got me. No way. Do you get uh, extra points if you take no damage? Toggle. Steal some of my glory. Oh yeah, I can use a toggle to airball, right? Yeah, toggle's an extra little juggling. I should be uh, definitely using. Keep your distance. Don't let them get away. Up him ravage them. Ah, see, should have jumped up then. That would have been cool. That would have been cool. Wait, so is Toggle unlimited? Can I keep my child as I launch? Yeah. Okay, you can. You can keep your charge. Get the boy, got boy. Airborne. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. We did what had to be done. Doesn't mean it has to be. I've also got all the counters no. and No, it doesn't. Uh, when have these Phoenix abilities that I've got, when have them on counter? I want another one. That's uh, it. The master jump. Get the bigger down thrust. Uh, but so I should have I should have three like Phoenix of the Lottery, right? Oh, the Fallen. Here you come, here come. I'm expecting something juicy here. <clears throat> An ancient, yeah, highly advanced civilization whose relics can be found over the earth Alicia, uh, Valestia, the material from which the relics are constructed is far sooner than still and cannot be worked by modern methods. So the people of the modern day have elected to build it inside and around the mystery. All right, so that's probably going to evolve out later on. Um, anything with the wood this way in recent years by the encroachment of the blight and the beast driven before it's so dangerous has it become that travellers really don't shrink. Right, I should have another phoenix bit, right? How do I get it? Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Are these only two I've got? Oh, yeah, these are the only two I've got. Okay. Rising Flame is a, yeah, uh, wait, was that the counter as well? Is that, is that, is that correct? This is, uh, how do I get more information on it? There was a section where I could receive more info. Is it the Rising Flames? Perform a combat enemy after launching into an increase here. It's... That was the other Phoenix Billy, weren't it? That was the uh, projectile counter. Or can you also counter with it? I don't think you could. Where are we going, Torgi? Torgo! Bloody lost dog. Oh, go for it. <clears throat> yeah, it's the third ability you get. Yeah. Alright, here we go. This is this is the boss fight arena. So no no heals. Zero gear. Wipe or no wipe? One, if I'm going to wipe a Rooney, if I'm going to get slapped. Two, if I'm going to make it. <sighs> Left stick. Oh, yeah, yeah, me for the uh, animal instinct. Yes. <laughs> 
that for Torgal. Hello! He looks like a guild. Hello, Gilbert. Slobber on, oh, mate. You'd better hope so. He's got more slobber on him in when my Domino's pizza this arrives. Too long. Which it never so did arrive in the end. They stole my pizza, guys. Still short, just not quite as quick. Ah, oh, really want to get that fifth. If you know my thoughts exactly. Oh. Oh. And he'd be. Okay, he's a bit more frequent in his Sick attacks. Ooh, okay, this. You know what to do, boy. Oh. Not this time. Oh no! Nice! Oh, as if I didn't dodge in time! Oh boys! Oh, I'm not looking good for Fafnir! Fa Fafnir! The old Norse dwarf that got turned into a dragon! He's coming after me! Oh man, I'm getting rolled! I ain't healing! I ain't healing! I ain't going! Half of these things out. Oh, fuck! Thought I could go over him. This is not good. This is not good. No, 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 no. Oh! There's the first wipe! <laughs> oh, yeah, I did like get hit by almost every single roly poly. Yeah, just it wasn't happening. Even when I thought I could go above. Oh this no! Mine is put my gear back on. I may have made a mistake. No, 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 I've made a mistake. Still short. Oh wow! Even caught me on the edge there. I thought I was definitely out of the way. Oh, I thought I could jump up to the head. <laughs> All these things I think I can do, but I can't do. Oh, I can just drop those out. There it is. Much better. Wow! That got me. Jesus, man. So if you get enough airtime, you can go all over the attacks. Oh no! I wanted to dodge. Oh man, I'm uh, getting my bum, I'm getting my bum touched. Just drop everything. Big damage. So, I haven't got my limit break yet. Oh, I missed the fifth one again. Someone's got the 
Yep. Where he stops, no one knows. Whew. There, boy. Ooh. I doubt we'll do that again. Not if we kill him first. Oh, way too early a dodge. Oh, man. I'm hanging out my boom. <laughs> Nope. I just got to play safe. Oh, I'm gonna be sorry. No, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, the tail. I don't know if I can get through this no heal. So this boss has a little bit more to him. Well, it's, it's more just the timings when you're getting greedy with your combos, like the fifth one, or you just wanted to try to air jump or something. Ah, oh, see it now. Phase reset. I like that. No one knows. I like that. But before, because I can already smell the comments. I have no gear on. I'm doing this naked. So don't chat shit. Too soon, too soon. My timings are out. My timings are out. <laughs> oh, dodge. Oh, just about, just about. Rolly, rolly. Get him, boy. Get him. Get him. Get him. He goes airborne. You go try to jump him. Oh, no, not then. Man, I meant to dodge and I think it shifted in. Not good. Ah, oh, God, I got to stop getting caught on his side. Double hit, double hit. Fucking double red. Not this time. Can I finish this? I'm going to get myself poom pooned. Oh no, here comes the rolly. Too slow. Oh god. Oh god, I'm one hit away from dying. Let's go! If I have no other North Lane. So I wonder if that'd be kind of cool. We have the North section. Fafnir from uh, see Norse mythology. If Jill's territory is kind of more Nordic based, that would be cool. Oh, that was fun. I, I do wish that the phases didn't reset though, and you had to you had to go from the uh, the start. That was a fun fight. That was a good fight. That was a good one. I covered in countless scars. These scales tell a tale of supremacy and survival, albeit. Are now ended. Uh, most this nondescript lump of earth. Okay, yeah, I'll give that. Woo.
So yeah, you don't have your limit break yet. So that's pretty OP. Oh, come on. Stand back. Now what a cry uh really why Sid? Doesn't that use some of your life force to do? You could have just done that the whole time. <laughs> that was such an unnecessary power-up. Yeah, look, it comes with a cost, bro. You're... You're a dominant. Why, Sid? That was the... I am. Dumbest. Right. Well, not by choice, mind. Old bloody Rome of strapping young lads. And it was this sorry sack of bones, Ramu, who saw fit to home. <laughs> Sid, you say you want to help dominance and bearers. <clears throat> well, what's in it for you? What? Yes, I I am still wondering what's this. What's in it for me? The same as for all of us. What we Sid has a deserve. motive. Save for our knack, dominance and bearers are no different from anyone else. The ability to use magic or summon great beasts should command respect, but instead has left us does outcasts. hate Barnabas. So. Our kind are used and discarded like tools, yet we are men, so why must we die as less? I see. So what you're saying is you want to start a war. <laughs> ah, you flatter me, lad. But my days as a firebrand are long behind me. No, I only wish to offer our kind of choice. A place where we can die on our own terms. Okay. So, a, a, a little bit like a war. Yes, Clivey boy. Questioning his motives. I've been wondering them myself. Ooh. So the game's giving me some... It's giving me some base healing. Um, wait, what's the... Uh, what's the challenge, Novus? Make it challenging and fun in the streams. Go on. What, what, what did I miss? What did I miss? <clears throat> I will offer a reward for every boss fight if done in one go and no heals. If felt, no reward. I mean, I, I am deeply, deeply hurt that I didn't get that one. <laughs> to be honest. Well, I'm, I'm going to... Uh, Am I to be naked as well? Or should I put gear back on? I don't know, I just... I'm going to take the challenge on. Right. It's just, I'm going to have to what exactly do you emotionally you handle the roasting that's going to come for me. What do you think? I'll show him the mercy he showed my brother. And cut out the tongue of any man who tries to talk me out of it. Alright. Forest dark <laughs> enough, was it? <laughs> There it is. That's my favorite. It's my favorite line of the game so far. <laughs> oh. Legit. These were. These were some of the uh, areas I camped up in Scotland. In fact, I would say this is almost like for like. There was one camping spot. Actually, it was when I went into Spain, the first, the first day in Spain. I got smuggled across on a boat, deserted on a beach. I didn't know what the fuck was happening. I got my gear and I pedaled. I pedaled up a mountain. And I, uh, there was a big national park and I weren't allowed in it because you can't camp in national parks. So I found a little side gully. And I had to climb through bushes and thick shit like this, trees everywhere. I found a little clearing. Legit. This is where I took my underwear off. This is where I set my tent up. There was actually a bush here that hid it and there was a town just off the ridge. But when I woke up, that was my view. Except instead of mountains, there was ocean on the left hand side. And I sat here, literally on rocks like this, with my brew. With my brew. I think I sent Bree some dick pics. And, um. Yeah, man. Let's take me back. 
Let's take you back. <clears throat> Nasty goblin boy. <laughs> I'm the goblin king. Nice, let's get some airborne. Boom! <laughs> Shot doesn't really do too much for letting you into the juggle. So main bosses, Anna or higher hunts. You have a reward with those terms. I like these terms. Here's where I don't manage to do it once the entire playthrough. Oh, there we go. That's a little bit. I didn't quite get the juggle right, but I started to see it a bit clearer then. Ah, oh, using stuff in the pocket. Ah, I biffed out completely. So, charge up. Damn, two people hit hard. See that river? We follow her upstream and we'll be in Lost Wing in no time. In no time. Right. I'm getting healing from mobs and this is obsessive. So squish, so very squish, squish, squish. Has <clears throat> Pez spent any uh, icon points? Yeah, I've, uh, I've bought a few. I'm uh, sort of saving up a bit. Um, oh, dominant. So those who, with whom it sleeps the power of an icon, uh, they can only not only cast element magics, but also transform themselves. <clears throat> Okay, so there's a few little side side parts you can lope off into. Did you really just put me into combat for those two mobs? Got a little got four old munchkins. Don't let this get away. How did I do the big charge shot in the air a minute ago? Keep your distance, boy. Very cool, very cool. Nice one, four gate. Oh, wow. That was really cool. You could just sort of dive in and the dive back out. No, I'm just going to try to jump over. Jumping over seems like a pretty risky maneuver most of the time. Start learning that combo. Oh, I'm never going to thrive. Keep your distance, boy. Ah, 
Ah, he flew up with me. Give them all you've got, boys. Does this count as a boss Novus? I think it does, right? the stream being guys I did a 30 minute episode now at the two and a half I right. guess once we go through here somewhere we'll, we'll have a little cutscene now I'm gonna have the discipline <laughs> much harder to muster discipline to come back I don't want to go <laughs> Right, so it's the left toggle, right? To, uh, to see where you're going next, it's over here, right? <clears throat> well, that is a damn glorious three hours of Final Fantasy 16. That is num num num. Beautiful, spellbounding, captivating. I still just I hate the paper mobs. Oh. Oh. Who's that? Is Royal that? Scout. Is that a Sam? Someone's freaky mob. Let's follow him. Is that a Sam Brecker? Is there a, is there a good upcoming section to leave? Ooh, Benedict is here. Okay. And yeah, they're just down that way, all of them. Grigor's my witness. Excellent. Oh, so there were were load, uh, <laughs> folks. We move. I, I I don't understand. Have I not proven loyal? God, really, dude? You, you didn't quit while you were ahead. It is true my liege values loyalty above all else. <laughs> but were you not quick to betray your countrymen for the promise of coin? <laughs> Bruh. Sid. Sid? Ben Dix is a savage. Huh? Why? Oh, what was that? Was that to put out the fire? <laughs> Benedicta Harman, commander of Walud's elite intelligences. If we can capture her... Benedict is certainly a presence on the screen. You! Weapons on the ground, Imperials! Oh! Wait, that means Benedict is gonna... Oh! Are we? Are we in a little show, showdown with Benedicta? No. Don't tell me she went off. She ain't gonna hear this commotion when we come back. Alright, fight some squishies first. Oh, this guy. Uh, Midnight Raven. Yeah, this, this dude has some skills. The lady in the wind! Oh, oh wow, okay. He came straight at me. Wait, this guy has the same skill set as the one in the demo. I know your move, sir! Extreme down thrust. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, oh, he jumped me. He jumped me. Oh, 
no, as I was sword charging. Oh, it is. This is a resilient fella. Will I wipe? No wipes. But naked. But I have a good stream. Crew Monroe, thank you. When the screen flashes, pivot moment, repeatedly tap. Uh, to press or fend off the attack. Oh no, fat fingers engaged. Oh, this is my weakness. Ah, oh, they made it easy. Thank you. Oh, ooh, ooh, midnight rave. Oh man, you've earned my respect. This guy's badass. No, he nearly just had Clive's head. This is a three and one. Right? I don't feel safe to Trid. As a waste. Cheeky boy. Cheeky boy with his teleports. What was that? From from mom? Oh, oh no, he's got me! Oh! Oh! oh. Bought me! Big suplex! Ah, oh, that hurt. I'll stop trying to air juggle because this guy can't be air juggled, so it's all just a bit pointless. Not this time. Oh man, he's all over the shot. Lady neck. Oh, I'm actually pretty low, so. Oh wow, that got me, I've been... Good night, sweet Regal. Come on, stagger in. Sid, what are you doing, man? Oh no, I accidentally used a potion. I thought I was on. Uh, so I take no more damage. Maybe if I take 20% more damage, I would have wiped. I thought I was on. I don't know how it's had to cross in two of them. That's deeply triggering. So I think I would have got this fight anyway. So I'm a fucking legend. The only thing better than my skills is my humility. Cinematic finish. Nice. Not this yeah, Benedict, you got, a, you got a skilled lad here. She didn't even come back his head. Guarantee it's going to be a chick under this hood. Oh, wow. Oh, damn. Really good night. <laughs> Woo! Nice. Not too bad, not too bad. I mean, I feel like I had practice from the demo. It was exactly the same. It 
was a juicy fight. We it's just, it'd be so much juicier if... Well, you do look the part. I've got to stop going about mobs, man. But the mobs meant anything. Well, you fight like Heck. a true shield of Rosaria. And one blessed by the Phoenix at that. The skill gap between Midnight Raven and his goons just... <laughs> Mad. Speaking of which, <clears throat> I wonder, does the other icon of fire give blessings, do you think? You don't believe me. And yeah, all the creator did make of the elements eight icons to serve as keepers of the one law. Yes. Not that I've ever set too much store by holy doctrine. But... Eight. Eight, cure. So that's, is that including Ifrit? In that, including Leviathan, Phoenix is part of the Pantheon. Can I not get into active time law at this point? Something on that. Phoenix, power, perform the rite of rejuvenation upon those. Yeah, yeah we know about that. Uh, Benedicta, yeah, Royal Knights of Willow, that's what they were. For myriad purposes, espionage and assassination among them. Uh, yeah. So, eight. At that point, it's clear. Fire has always had just the one warden, as of all the rest. A new one can't be born until the previous dies. And even that can take years. Take years. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> you don't strike me as a liar. So the accidental heal was one potion. It wasn't enough Which that I would have wiped. One person <laughs> who might be able to shed some light on the matter. I wouldn't mind if you could count it. Swing. Dude, thank you, man. I have no this As our Aluda friends, I would imagine. We should hurry Thank before it gets dark. <laughs> but what if someone discovers the bodies? Uh, I might just well, take potions off. I'll be sorely disappointed. <sighs> Damn, even, even Torg has got some blood splatter up him. Even the Doge. <laughs> I don't know. It's very questionable to be when Sid's using his powers or not. <laughs> but I needed that during Midnight Raven. Not, not a half half dead Fafnir. Uh, stage replay and archive mode are now available. Oh, so you can come back and uh, you can level. Through the play. Do you, do you actually gain level? Like can, you can level yourself ahead. Make yourself a bit OP, a bit strong. Um, so what do we think guys, before going into the next section, shall we leave it there, or is there a little bit further I should press? Um, I mean that, that feels that feels like a chapter, a pretty solid chapter to close. Um, anything more would just be me not resisting the temptation, and then more cool things will happen, and it will just make it harder. <laughs> uh, but wow, and a really, really fun. Three-ish, yeah, three hours, that opening, Solid, solid gameplay, but I already knew that from the demo. Um, that wood really got me. <sighs> That's what I was hoping through in this playthrough. To just hit some environment that would give me that. <laughs> uh, we're, we're learning the lore at uh, quite a cool unfolding pace. Um, right, what's this next place? We're going Orabel Down. Vidalic plains that stretch across the south, southern reach of the Holy Empire. Sparsely populated. Unless one knows where to look. But yeah, having uh, an FF look this good, I was honestly in the camp of thinking that Final Fantasy would never kind of charge the frontier of graphical fidelity. And I certainly didn't think we would uh, have it with 16. I really did expect when we first, uh, first saw uh, the 16 trailer, I thought, yeah, this could be more story focused. It's not looking to be a triple A museum game. It's not going to be on the cutting edge. And I was kind of glad for it, but it is, man. And like looking at the difference between the trailers as well, the first trailer, and then the newer ones, and then even just going from what's even better, 16 example where the game looks better than even in the trailers, man. When you're actually in it, it actually looks even better, even more pristine. And uh, 
It just feels so good, man. It just feels so good that this is the Final Fantasy that we've got. This is the Final Fantasy, Fantasy that we deserved. But yeah, that's as far as I got so perfect. Yeah, I feel like any further I'm going to start charging ahead of people. Uh, and I, I don't want that. So, um, yeah, I'm going to leave that episode there. But <clears throat> very cool setup, especially when you take into account everything that happened through the demo as well. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I'll, I'll take potions off in, in future. But yeah, thank you so much, uh, Mr. Novus. Thank you, Jun Bun. Thank you for all the follows, um, all the subscribes. Uh, this is England. Thank you for the bits, mate. Cloud KJ. Um, <clears throat> Torgo doesn't really do anything with his heels, really, so it's up to you, man. Yeah, I mean, uh, Torgo, Torgo's heel is very, very minimal, right? But sometimes when you're trying to do combos, it's with my, my big old monkey paw. Sometimes I button mash a little bit. <laughs> Ooh. But yeah, that was um, really sick the way they introduced Jill back in the story. Scissor I, I, uh, entrance was also very, very cool. Very badass. Uh, I think we had three or four of those cinematically sweet slow modes. Ooh. And they literally add that sound effect on as well. Oh, every time those hit, I feel, I feel a little punch of adrenaline. That, that had kind of a mix of everything. They had a bit of feels, had some adrenaline, mutual savagery. Um, could not want more. It, it feels like an age ago, I put out this video saying Final Fantasy M rated, M rated plus. Talking about why I think the next mainline Final Fantasy will go M rated, why I think it should, why I think the fan base is ready for it. I had a lot of mixed feedback on that video. The biggest one on people who even said they wanted it, they were like, I'd actually quite like it, but Square definitely won't do it. There was so much cynicism on that video. But I was like, no, I think, I think they're going to do it. And uh, why they should. And arguably, that was back in the day when Square Enix used to actually take notice of me. So it's possible, guys, that they saw that video and I'm entirely to credit for Final Fantasy VI 16 existing. I, I might be entirely to thank. So, if that doesn't get a subscribe or a like out of you, I don't know what else will. Which team do you think will make uh, 17? I mean, we can we can presume. Um, I don't know. It's gonna it's gonna be one of the other business divisions. It's not gonna be uh, D Division Five or Three. Um, you know, I think they're gonna be locked up. I mean, Division Three even after this. They're going to be doing the PC version. Um, now that's what they said. They're going to take their sweet time with it, though. It'll be six month after the six month uh, PS5 exclusive contract it expires. And then by the sounds of it, Yoshi P is definitely going to be. Um, if this game is doing well, again, I don't want to know the reviews. I don't want to know how it's doing online. But Yoshi P said, depending on the feedback and how well the game do does, then they will consider DLC, extended content. And that right there is the game telling me to shut up. <laughs> the stream's telling me to shut up. One mic just died. Okay. Uh, out of interest, guys, does this uh, mic sound less quality? Does this sound worse? I feel like I tried this out and it, it sounded problematic. I don't know if I broke it. <laughs> 
Or does it sound the same to you guys? Or is it much, much worse? <clears throat> yeah. On that note... Oh, Jesus. I should bounce once your mic start running out of juice. <laughs> it's probably to signal the end. Um, but yeah, I, I think that both Business Division 3 and 5 are going to be uh, having intermediate projects um, way before 17. Big, cool, intermediate, juicy projects. Slightly worse. I thought that as well when I listened to this mic back. It sounds worse for some reason. I don't know why. It's exactly the same kind. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for popping in the stream. I honestly was not expecting almost 100 viewers, or over 100 viewers, most of the stream, <laughs> especially with the number of people who are playing out there and recognizing that most of you guys want to play through it yourself before you uh, you see anything. So the fact that just to have you this many people here, experience that this way. It feels so good. It feels so good. <coughs> Anything before I uh, <coughs> bounce off, guys? Uh, Pets, have you heard of Night Sky Print? These are FF YouTube will make for a great collab. <laughs> I've heard of Night Sky, of course. Me and him chat. We chat. We've, uh, we've done a po uh, podcast together. We actually did it on um, Schrodinger's, uh, and I've been on his channel as well, actually. Yeah, I did uh, an episode on his channel, and I did an episode with Schrodinger's. Oh, nice guy. He's a good lad. He's a good lad. <clears throat> uh, anything before I finally bounce, guys? <sighs> Ooh, I feel so much joy. <laughs> the amount of joy I get from this series. It just feels so good. It feels so good to know that I'm still capable of getting this level of happiness infused into my wee little peasanty body. It's a sign that. Adulthood hasn't jaded me too much, but just a little. If you reach adulthood and you haven't been jaded a little bit, you haven't, you haven't lived a full enough life. <clears throat> All the streamers got the stream a day early uh, with it. Yeah, I mean, I'm basically the only person, the only streamer, the only, I think it's that word, influencer. The only internet personality that Square Enix hasn't given shit to. Everyone else has not only... I mean, I did have an opportunity to connect with them. I think it's because I didn't. Because I was traveling, so I'm like, fuck this guy. But, you know, going to the event I was fine with, I draw a line at everyone else, even those motherfucking channels that barely even cover this series. They'd be getting those mugs, man. They'd be getting, like, these cool little cards, or these Sam Breek arts. They get, they, Square Enix basically sent a goodie box to loads of channels. Where's my goodie box, Square? Where's my flagon? I want a fucking wooden flagon. And it's one of those big hearty sort of like old tavern pub style ones, like medieval yaha fiddly D. I don't care about the tea stained cards, quite frankly, but the mug, I think I was gonna say the mug, the mug, the mug hurt. Made me feel like a mug. They asked you for the press event. Perhaps you were on holiday and they misunderstood you. Yeah, I mean, they asked me to the press event. But I was in Asia. Oh. <laughs> but it's fine. I, uh, I, don't care. I, like, I like just doing things in my own space, in my own hole. But don't worry, you have the best community. God damn right. God damn right. <laughs> you know the other thing that's really making me... Uh, a bit anxious is I cannot wait to cover this game once we finished do uh, the story explained do the breakdowns of it do some theories um, or I mean even still expanding on my lore and deep diving and tunneling what's just make me anxious that everyone else is going to beat me to it I'm still going to do it it's going to be like a month from now I might have to cover stuff as we go through it, but then I'm worried about that because people want small. I know, it's just crazy to see that most other streamers, their approach is to complete 16 as fast as humanly possible. So I feel like I'm going to be the last person. 
Pairs next, VA for FF17. Let's go! <laughs> I've got too much of an insufferable, um, annoying voice. <laughs> and I would... I, I don't know. I, I don't know if I'd be able to keep up the professionalism. I don't think they hate you, Pairs. <laughs> Maybe. Alright. Anyway, guys, before I make this stream much longer, have a great run if you're playing 16 today, or whenever you're playing it, or whatever you're doing. I hope you feel that same level of joy. Thank you for coming in, guys. And uh, I will be back again 1 p.m. EST time. Same time as today. And uh, yeah, I'm going to see if I can get this licensing issue fixed. But stellar opening. Uh, that has done nothing but just increment my confidence even more um, I just hope 16 keeps evolving out from here please let the story be good please say it's not getting tanked on me the right now please say I'm not on the edge of soul crushing despair because I am at this point utterly convinced I'm about to have a mind blowing experience and uh, we could Generally, genuinely, genuinely have a competitor for all of our like, at least at least top five, but maybe even top three, if not a favourite Final Fantasy shit. Could I be on the edge of of having Type Zero, FF7, 13 2, and I have some weird picks, 10 2, dethroned? Are you 16? Or are you total booty bum cheeks? What are you? Playing it so far, you seem like you seem like the former. <laughs> Peace out, homies. Toodle pip. Ciao. I don't have to do anything. I don't have to save anything, do I? I don't know. Murdoch. Murdoch. We've got Murdoch in the house. Yeah, you got crisped up, son. How are you back? <laughs> Bree, my sweet. Mega Magical Megan. Until the next live stream. Yeah, man. Ooh. I can't see the button tip on the stream. Uh.